After all the shit we've been through, I'm starting to wonder if I'm cursed. Yeah, why is that? Because out of the whole human race, you're the one flying toward the mysterious alien artifact with the dead guy? Yeah. You're just following your program. Just like me. Program? Mm -hmm. I always had this crazy notion about free will. Then how come it is that every time there's some clusterfuck shitstorm situation in the universe, there's James Holden shrugging shoulders saying, how the hell did I end up here? You're really pumping me up for this mission. You're the patron saint of lost causes, kid. We're running from it. Tell me what that thing is. Yeah, just as soon as we get down there, we'll both know. I should have brought a gun. Wouldn't do you any good. I calmed down and station security. It's about the only thing protecting you right now. Mm, comforting. Except these guys. Got a little company. Ah, Martians. They're not happy with me. Just collecting pals wherever you go, huh? What are you doing? I'm trying not to get caught. Slow down. Remember what I said about doors and corners? Don't start with that shit again. Hey, you're no good to me if the station squashes you like a bug. Slow down! Just exercising some free will. I ain't just being an asshole. I repeat, we are ordering you to break off your present course so we can bring you aboard in protective custody. You will not be harmed. James Holden, please respond. Shit! He's not slowing down. Not even a bit. He's still got a ton of velocity to shut unless he's planning on going through that thing instead of to it. What do you think is gonna happen when he reaches it? Maybe little green men will come out. Maybe boom. Hopefully nothing. Sir, may I give it a try? Do it. Holden, Bobby Draper here. Really? Yeah, it's me. I need you to slow down. Shut the fuck up, I'm trying to... Sorry, Bobby, I wasn't talking to you. Are you on another channel? What? No, I mean, yes, yes. Another channel. Will you just shut up for Who a are you second? talking to, Holden? Monkeys and microwaves. Holden, are you alright? Exactly. Holden, you need to slow down and let us bring you in. Just give me a minute. I promise we'll hear you out. I didn't blow up the sun moon, and Alex and Amos had nothing to do with it either. I gotta go. Get him back. I can't. He's locked us out of his comms. That man sound rational to you? Not entirely. No, sir. He did not. Yeah, I concur. He's cracked. Everyone's got a breaking point. I'm sure he's not the only one in this godforsaken place. Do you even know what the case is? Yeah, sure, it's, uh, we gotta find a records room, and then we gotta read the files, and then we see what's what. You tell me what that is, and I'll keep going. Sometimes I... I know stuff's too big for my head. There used to be uh, something here, a lot of something, a uh, civilization, billions of years ago. But now, 
All that's left is a bunch of locked doors and some lights on the timer. So what do we do? We figure out how to pick the locks. Ah, uh, they're getting closer. Can you stop them? Sure, I get the station to stop them permanently. No, 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 don't do that. Hmm. Then keep moving. into this place. Yeah, I have a knock to the record. See, they're locked, remember? So you can, you know, turn the key. Well, what do you need me for? Because you exist, OK? That's why. You seem real enough. OK. A couple hundred billion brain cells in your skull. You got more synapses than stars in the universe. You are a fancy hand terminal. Buttons. With a lot of buttons. And I push a few trillion of them buttons in exactly the right way. To that, you're talking to Miller. The sound of his voice, the clothes he wore. Plus a hat. Yeah, I like the hat. Plus, uh, I'm pushing the buttons. So it's a magic trick. So is your whole damn reality, kid. Just different buttons being pushed. Maybe I'm the illusion inside your head. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm trying to keep things simple here for you, okay? Calculus, amoeba. Monkey, Mozart. 